DJI announced yesterday a launch date for its brand new drone, the DJI Avada Cinewoop. In this video, I will go over a list of leaked detailed specs for the Avada, obtained from Drones XL. Let's get started. Let's dive right into the camera specs. We are going to get a 1 over 1.7 CMOS sensor, a 48 megapixel camera, a field of view of 155 degrees, which is really wide, an aperture at f2.8, fixed focus, and an ISO range, that's how much light is let into that sensor, of 100 to 25,600, which is really going to be excellent for low light situations. Now the video with the DJI Goggles 2 will come in at 4K with 50 frame, frame, frames per second or 60 frames per second. 2.7K at 50, 60, and 100 frames per second and 1080p at 50, 60, and 100 frames per second. With the previous goggle version, the V2, you're going to get the same specs on the 4K, but with the 2.7 and the 1080, it can go as high as a 120 frames per second. And I'm not entirely sure why there is a difference between the goggles 2 and V2. Now for video file formats, you're going to get the option of H.264 and H.265, which is great for reducing those file sizes but maintaining the high quality. You're also going to get electronic image stabilization with the Rocksteady 2.0 and the Horizon Steady. Now in the previous video, I talked about it is a single gimbal axis, not a three axis. So this electronic image stabilization is gonna come in huge when it comes to great footage. The weight of the drone is in grams at 410. Now the speed, let's talk about that. In the previous video, I talked about the speed just being the sport mode at 14 meters per second or 31 miles per hour. But it looks like there will be an option for manual, which will give us 27 meters per second and or the equivalent of 60 miles per hour. And in normal mode, you're going to get 8 meters per second or 17 miles per hour. Now, the flight time on the battery, just hovering, is 18 minutes. So you know that battery is not going to last long, probably half as much, down to 9 minutes when you're actually flying the drone. The internal storage is 20 gigabytes, which is amazing. You will still be getting the downward vision sensors. And the operating frequency for your RF is going to be 5.725 to 5.85 gigahertz. Now in live view mode with the current version goggles V2, you're going to get a low latency of 810p with 120 frames per second and the high quality 810p with 60 frames per second. And with goggles 2, the brand new goggles are coming out with the current Nevada, you're going to get a low latency mode 810p 120 frames per second and on the high quality 810p 60 frames per second. And the transmission range for your signal to the drone from your remote is going to be six miles. If you're enjoying these leaked videos, please consider subscribing to the channel, giving this video a thumbs up. Tomorrow I will be releasing a new leaked video for all the accessories that are coming out for the DJI Avada Cinewoop. And if you'd like to check out more videos from this channel, you can click or tap over here. All right. Done and done.